I'm going to show you how to calculate your fantasy points. Make sure you have a weekly point sheet with your team's name on it. Pause the video as necessary. Do so now and go to this website. Once you're at the website, you will see all 32 NFL teams. Find your team, and when you do, click on their name. My team is the Indianapolis Colts. This takes me to the team page. As you can see, I'm 7-3, and three, and I'm first in the AFC South. So I'm going to record that on my weekly point sheet. Now, I'm going to scroll down the page and find my team's schedule. I want to know the last game we played in. There it is. Week 11, we won 30-27 to against the Tennessee Titans. So I will update my weekly point sheet with that information. Then, click on box score. This will take you to this page where you'll find statistics for the game. On the right side, you will find a box that says Team Stat Comparison. We will be using that in a moment. But for now, scroll down the page and find Passing and Rushing. I want to know how many yards we passed for. 229 and no touchdowns. We ran for 137 yards for three touchdowns. So I'm going to record that in my weekly point sheet. The next thing I want to know is my turnover information. So I will scroll up the page and I'll find how many turnovers I had. As you can see, I did not have any turnovers, so I will record that in my weekly point sheet. Now we're going to look at defensive categories. Scroll down the page and look for the category that says defense. There are a lot of statistics here, but the one we care about is sacks. Look at the totals, and as you can see, my team had two sacks. I'll record that on my weekly point sheet. I want to know how many yards the other team was able to accumulate on my defense. So I will scroll up the page, find my opponent, Tennessee, and I will look at how many yards they were able to accumulate. 340 and I'll put it on my weekly point sheet. Next, I'm going to do the math. From the table, I will see how many points I should include for yards allowed and record it on my weekly point sheet. My last step is to sum up all of my points this is the total weekly fantasy points for my team.